The Ministry of Health has put in isolation a number of people suspected to have been in close contact with a 24-year-old man who succumbed to the Ebola virus disease on 19th of September. We have uh, about 10 suspects who are currently isolated uh, and also yesterday another death was registered, a, facil a facility death which we are awaiting uh, test uh, results from Uganda Virus Research Institute alongside these 10 uh, suspects who are, who are in uh, isolation. The spokesperson of the Ministry of Health, Emmanuel Ainebiona, says they have deployed national rapid response teams in Mubende, the epicenter, the neighboring districts of Chiboga, Mitiana, Chivali, Chankwanzi, Gomba, Kazo, Kakumiro, Kasanda, Chegegwa, as well as Kampala such that they are able to activate all the district task forces and also orient all health workers uh, in preparedness of any suspected cases around the Mubende district. Meanwhile, the Bwekula MP Pascal Mbabazi has appealed to the Ministry of Health to double their efforts in containing the disease. Creating awareness to our people, having radio programs, making barazas, small, small meetings where we can disseminate information about the dangers of this outbreak. In more developments, some neighboring countries, including Kenya and South Sudan, have asked their citizens to be extra alert following the Ebola outbreak in their neighbor, Uganda. Health Ministry Permanent Secretary Dr. Diana Twina says the Ebola outbreak will not affect travel, but urged people to be cautious to avoid catching the deadly disease. I want to assure the public and the international community that Uganda is well known for handling epidemics. And therefore, we have capacity, we have the skills, we have what it takes to contain this Ebola. The symptoms of Ebola include muscle pain, sore throat, vomiting, bloody diarrhea or urine, bleeding from body openings, high fever, headache and body weakness. Ebola is spread through direct physical contact with body fluids like blood, saliva, stool, vomit, urine, and the sweat of an infected person or animal. Walter Mwesije, NTV.